Hey guys, this is Tim and James with Tabletop Terrors. We are doing the RPG a day video series, and right now we are on question number 13. This is kind of a toughie. What makes a successful campaign? Uh, so I think when you're running for president of the United States, um, it's very important now, not that kind of campaign. Um, oh man, I was waiting for that knowledge to drop. <laughs> Just for when you run as president of the, I already of the am. campaign of verse. Um, so to me, uh, one of the most important things about making a game enjoyable for the long term is having a uh, having sort of story arcs, having a thing you're working toward that you eventually get to. Um, I haven't played in many long term campaigns, but I in the few that I have, some of them have been like just you're always doing something. You know, it's almost like a show where it's Monster of the Week, or you know, a few sessions maybe you get through a dungeon, but that's it. You know. You get back to town, and that's cool, and you look for the next plot hook. There's nothing wrong with that, but when I started playing online, I learned that there is more than that. That right. it can be like, no, you know, you're looking for this person. Your character wants something, and they're doing everything they can to get it. And eventually they will get it, and that will come with its own set of problems. And it's just, I feel like you can play a campaign for years and years and years and hundreds of sessions. Mm -hmm. But it's important to make sure that it feels like things wrap up, and it feels like there's a natural pace and some sort of order to what's going on. It's not just ongoing, you're just you know, right. living life. It's still a story. Sure. And what makes a great album? Right? Talk about an endless conversation there. I think to me, the most important thing is what makes a successful campaign is everything he said and then compare it to who's playing in it. Um, the most important thing we need to realize is even with the same group, the exact same campaign probably wouldn't work back to back. Yeah. Right? So in other words, the different moods, the different inspirations, the different things they're drawing from, the different movies that are out, all these things that are co compiling to make the player feel inspired, uh, it wouldn't work even in six months sometimes. So it's important to know who you're playing with and what they think. Yeah. It's like, hey, here's what I expect. I want a, uh, you know... Uh, intrigue heavy campaign where I can work my way through a political ladder and be uh, at the end of the campaign. I want to be in a, in a position of power. Yeah. That's different than I want to find a relic, you know, inside a volcano and slay a dragon. But for me, what really makes a successful campaign is exactly what you're saying. And I want to really hammer home. It has to be the, completion or non-completion of goals yeah closure in some way like he said the arcs are so important to me um if you're the kind of group that gets together and everything all week you know you play and then it's just okay what's the next one what's the next one that's awesome go for it but to me in the same way that we enjoy fiction um of any kind films books the arcs are a character having a challenge growing in some way Overcoming or not overcoming that challenge, and then the fallout of how that changes them. Yeah, exactly. That's what I want. It's all about change. It's exactly what it is for me. Um, that's why a campaign can be super good, but then the next one has to be different because if you're playing the same characters, you can't go through the same arc. Yeah, you've you changed know? now. You're different exactly. Now, so you have to go through something else. Right. Now, there are what I would consider like Indiana Jones campaigns, which is like, listen... Indiana Jones doesn't change as a character. He's the same within reason. He's the same character in all the films. He doesn't really have an arc. He doesn't really change. He's the guy. He's the guy. He's the guy. He's the same. That's also okay. If it's that more episodic, if that's what you're going for. But just know that really on a long enough timeline, there's probably going to be a point where you're like, man, I want something more. Yeah. Um, so that's to me. I'm all about arcs. I'm all about not always succeeding, but making sure that something either happens where I succeed or fail, and then what's the fallout and how does that work? Exactly. So, um, yeah. So comment below. Let us know what you think makes a successful campaign. Let us know if you agree, disagree, uh, you know, what's missing from our formula here. Sure. And be sure to check out BrigadeCon.org. Uh, check it out. It is a 24 hours of gaming for Child's Play on October 29th, 2016. And, uh, yeah, check it out. Sign up. Learn more about it. Absolutely. And uh, make sure you like this video, subscribe, check out our other RPG A Day videos, and until next time, may your dice roll high.